We'll gather with a bell. Come in to safety, security, stillness, and quiet. You may be standing, seated, lying down, eyes opened or closed. Whatever feels right to you at this very moment. Your breathing, your pulse is flowing, your organs are active in digestion and other processes. Take stock. You don't have to make any changes, just Use a generous awareness and kindly attention to notice the miraculous nature of your body just as it is. Even with occasional or chronic aches and pains, you get to be alive. Sometimes difficult, sometimes delightful. Existence is always miraculous. Take stock. Begin to slow down. Starting with your breath, taking it in deeper and letting it go slower. Sometimes by slowing breath, we can also slow the mind. Let the chatter release and dissolve. Never stopped. That's only available to us after this life. But not fixated either. Just vibrating, moving, drifting. Thoughts unspool. Slowing down, enjoying the quiet and the stillness Settling in. What do you notice inside and outside your body? Sounds, sensations, just be curious, interested in the world inside and outside of you. Microcosms.
Let's do a body scan starting with our toes and feet. Notice your toes, wiggle them, shake your feet. They do some great work. Think something kind about them. As simple as, you guys really get me where I'm going. Thanks. Or something more personal. Do something similar with your legs. Your hips. Congratulate them, thank them, be grateful. Your belly and torso. Give them some honor in words or just sensation, feeling. Your arms, you guys rock, you could say, or something more serious, whatever suits you. Breathing, settling, neck, head, Brain, mind, consciousness. You are the best you that has ever existed. We're going to explore aspects of love. Let's begin with considering simple loves. Tree, flower, a pet, swimming, things that are uncomplicated and inevitable. Feel it. Where does it light you up? When you think about that love for an object, where do you feel it in your body? What sensations does it bring up? feelings. Just notice and go into that good feeling.
How do you feel when your pet loves you? Or the world embraces you? The ocean calls you to swim or sail. Can you take love in? Sometimes that's even harder. Take a few breaths as you absorb love in and out. Let's think of family and friends colleagues and siblings, the people in your day-to-day life. Some relationships are straightforward, some more complex, but all involve some measure of loving To exist with another person requires us to find something lovable about them. Even your boss. Even someone on the subway. Where does that love come from in your body? Notice it. You don't have to pinpoint or put word to it, but just sense, generally, embodiment of love. giving it away, constantly replenished like a spring, pouring forth. You have it in you. How do you feel when some of the same people treat you with affection, compassion, and love? Where does it fill you up? Let it come in. Being loved is not easy. Take a few breaths, getting still and steady, calm and quiet. Romantic and intimate love, now or perhaps in the past. You could picture one person or just 
the experience. What did it feel like to pour out love to someone romantically? Is it held in the same place in your body as simpler loves, family and friends, pets? Is it a different embodied experience? Just notice, curious, generous. See what you notice. Being loved in return. Ah, it's a good feeling and also scary. Sometimes desired, sometimes surprising. But always powerful. Take it in. Notice it flowing through your life then and now. Sometimes requited, sometimes unrequited, but always loving. Part of the human condition. Take a few breaths, absorbing. Finally, a deep love, a love of self. You could conceptualize it as God, a higher power, the universe, or just yourself loving yourself. But it is real, safe and trustworthy. Give that to yourself. Feel it throughout your body. I love you. You are the best you to exist. Whatever words feel appropriate or sensations convey that. Go with it. Let it bloom. Breathing. <laughs> 